Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, I'm Sam Casey 4 and welcome back to episode 3 of The Expanse, where today we're going to do the same as we did for episode 2. I'm going to go through, play the entire episode, and then during editing I'll find a nice spot to cut it, and we'll have half this week, half next week, in time for the fourth episode of the week after. So, let's get in and see what you've got in store for Drummer this week. If you are receiving this message, it means you've found us at last. You've come, and with you comes the next great step in the evolution of humanity. We have been preparing for your arrival for years, perhaps centuries. We have been patient. We know you have much to teach us. If you can hear my voice, whoever you are, welcome home. It just repeats after that. Who was that? The head of the station, presumably. Whoever he was, he's long gone now. Generations ago, millions of Earthers tried to set up mining stations in the belt. Some of them lasted. Some died off right away. And some of them, no one knows. Still, a station this large, uncharted and seemingly uninhabited? It's like nothing I've heard of. What did the initial scans tell us? None of the scanners penetrate past the first level. But there are no heat signatures, no activity, except this broadcast. Looks clear. Okay, do we go... Ooh, this, um... Yeah, let's see if anyone else is looking. We'll take that one. Maybe. But we don't know if the pirates have found the coordinates another way. Or anyone else. Not to mention, how the fuck are we gonna find it in there? The place is massive. There was a line in the coordinates. Something about... the first ones. What does that mean? Well, no, till we get inside. Arlen, Rayan, stay on the ship. Be ready to burn hard if there's any activity on the radar. Jo Ting, boss man. Good hunting. Maya and I will head inside and search around. Exactly how old is this place? Too old to be on any maps. Maybe a hundred years? Damn. This is fucking strange. Let's search for the command center. Found it. Over here. Oh, that was quick. I've never seen helmets this old. Crazy that people used to wear these into the vacuum. Help. Where? Helmet. Where's... Helmet. Oh, there. I see them now. Sorry, I didn't see that there. Okay. I thought I was looking at something else, but... Okay, fine. Alright, well, let's... An entire station 
completely abandoned. I can't even imagine what could have happened here. Maybe we'll find out. As long as it's on the way to finding the MK core. Yeah, but before we look at that, I'm not gonna. I'm gonna suggest it's not a battle. There's no corpses. There's no marks of fight. So the station is ancient, but the nav beacon is new tech. Okay, so is that suggesting that there's somebody else around, or the ox power okay. is on these breaker keys? The sector is now powered. There are three total. Each should have its own control room like this. Three sectors. I'll go ahead to find the control centers in each one. You keep scanning the servers for any leads. Fine. Have the fun to yourself. I'll call you once I power up the next sector. Okay, can we... Yeah, let's have a quick chat with her in a minute. See how um, things are going after um, our last little get-together last time. We still haven't talked about last night. Probably should keep it that way for now. Okay, fine. About last night. Yeah, Cap. Tell us about last night. Which one of you made all those noises? <laughs> Sounded like a coyo stuck on a... Ah, Falota! Get off this channel! Okay, fine. Right. Well, uh, yeah. Keep it quiet for now. The idea of exploring this whole station doesn't appeal to me. But whoever said riches came easy. Okay, well, I enjoy a good search, but... Okay, who scratched that off? And is that Cathedral? Yeah, Cathedral. Okay, so Sector 1, 2, 3, Classrooms, Med Bay... Comms, but now it's cathedral and mining tunnels. Okay, fine. But it looks like, yeah, it's one into classrooms, into two med bay, three cathedral, then the tunnels. Okay, fine. I guess. Yeah, I guess we're not going that way. Okay. Right. Oh. Who the hell is that? Okay, well, that seems to be the way I have to go. I don't have a choice. Okay. Hello? Who are you and what are you doing down here? Oh, it's a corpse. Okay, it's only a corpse. Um, Praying, I think. There's a dead body here. He seems almost... Post. That's weird. Do you think it's related to the core? Don't know. I'll keep searching around. Okay, well, let's examine the body. The last one? Huh. What does this mean? Okay, I've l I leave this message having surrendered this sector to the vacuum to preserve my body for what comes next. Trust Dalton, trust the signal, we will live again. The last one. Okay. Okay. This group called itself the Cassiopeia Collective. Landed here in 2226. They were an unlicensed settler community from Earth. What happened to them? No clue. Nothing good by the looks of it. Okay. Well, I know it can move vertically, but I'd rather just spin the camera around. Thank you very much. And at least you can see where I'm going. Okay. Doesn't seem to have been anything on the way down. Oh god, what have I set off now? Connect the junction. All oh, right, okay. Right. We're about to hit the greatest score a scavenger has ever come across. That's what he said. So, what do you plan to do with it? The money, I mean. 
I'll head back to Ceres. You want to go back to the station where there's a bounty on your head? With this money, I can make the bounty disappear. How? By going to war with Dawes? By making him irrelevant. I'm going to build an OPA that actually helps Belters. Okay, right. I'll connect you. Guessing this is why it's was telling me about using vertical. That's fine. Oh. Okay, we've got a bit of a puzzle on here, but left looks like it's a dead end, so connect it down. There we go. And okay, it's not exactly the most difficult puzzle in the world. There we go. Right. Probably actually one of the easiest puzzles in the world to do. Okay. Next. Hello. Danger. Right. It's not gonna let me in there. Fine. Okay. I don't like the look of this room. Get ready for any quick events. Try not to panic when they do jump up at you. Salota. Drummer? What happened? Dead bodies. Many of them. Oh God, is this the zombie episode? I'll head to the power. Then we can investigate it together. Now you want to include me? Fantastic. So what about you? What are you going to do with your share? I... I don't know. I haven't thought about it. Felota, you must have some idea. Ooh, um... You could pick a station to settle in. Set up shop as an engineer. I could. I'd miss flying around, though. Maybe I'll buy the Artemis off Khan. You can call me captain for a change. Ah. Uh. This ship has had enough mutinies already. Okay. A bit slow on the uptake there, but never mind. We got an answer out of her anyway. Right. Okay. Bit of salvage. Fine. Keep an eye out for that because I have no idea if that's going to be useful or not down the line. Ooh. Oh, yeah. We knew this was going to be the school area. Okay. So, a couple of desks at the back. I'm not familiar with the Dalton Principle. Something tells me it's not exactly accepted science. Okay. Our galaxy, the Milky Way, is estimated to be 87,000 light years in diameter. Out of 100 billion planets, 300 million have the properties for life. This is known as the Goldilocks Zone, according to the Fermal Paradox. Intelligent life must have developed in our galaxy. Without bacterial oxygen exposure, human bodies can remain free from decomposition indefinitely due to Moore's law. We can predict that medical technology will grow more effective every year. This makes the potential for advanced alien civilizations or future human civilizations limitless. Taken all together, the Dalton Principle states that the resurrection of infected corpses in stasis by advanced civilization, human or alien, is a question of when, not if. Okay, interesting. I mean, quite a lot of people do actually believe that. And it would be nice to think that that would be possible. So, okay. Oh. Wait a minute. Okay, I guess it's one way to, um, yeah, get rid of the fear of death if, you know, you just think you're going to be woken up somewhere down the line by advanced humans or aliens. Okay. Next life goals. Strange lesson for children. Hmm. Or anyone. Okay, see my brother, see mummy, try swimming, climb a mountain, thank the aliens, eat ice cream. Whoever that kid is, they're the best. Yeah, B 
become Secretary General, fight the bacteria, ride a spaceship. Okay, no, I want to know who picked eat the eat ice cream. That's my favourite. I want to be friends with that one. Okay. And... Bodies in the vacuum don't decompose. I guess that was the lesson. Okay. Fine. So, okay, biology lessons and... Well, is it biology or... Well, biology, yes, meaning the decomposition, but the other bit, I'm not sure what you class that as. And... Oh, okay. These aren't just coffins. They're designed to keep corpses in stasis, virtually forever. Right. And... Okay. This is creepy. I love it. But all of this planning and effort just to prepare for their own deaths. Okay. The question is, you know, what were they? Well, we kind of know what they were expecting to happen, but all right, well, let's get you. This feels like grave robbing, even more so than usual. I know. But just think of the historical value. These were some of the first people to try and survive out here. Does historical value pay well? Beats me. Depends who you ask. Looks like they were pulling walls off the station to fashion these caskets. Big Pagal. Okay, don't know what that means, but okay. Meaning the Big, big, big Pagal thing. No idea what that translates as. So, okay, we'll just move on. I am kind of picking up some of the terminology. Um, okay, scan the computer. It seems to be working still. Okay, new mission log. Fine. Um, what about you? Reading this message. You'd hardly know they'd given up on surviving and are putting all their hope in. Aliens? By unanimous vote, the Cassiopeia Collective has decided to decommission all biomass recyclers and break them apart for materials. We thank all collectives who participated in the hearing and look forward to a brighter future ahead. We have entered phase three of the realignment plan laid out in last month's collective assembly. All regular mining operations have been suspended. Mining employees, please report to your post at regular call to be reassigned. Management will communicate new plans for breaking down and repurposing construction materials. Once a suitable amount of materials have been collected, we will commence phase four to begin construction of stasis coffins. Designs have been posted in the comms hub for comments before next month's assembly. Okay. Right. Interesting. So, keep on... A minute. Nope, that's the, I've already done that room. Okay. Oh. Okay. On to the... Yeah. This should be the power room thing. Hmm. Okay. Yeah. There we go. That's what we were looking for. Who's going to jump out at me? Yeah, I'll turn that on in a moment. I just want to quickly check around. Nobody's, you know, floating around, hiding. Okay, can't see anyone, so... Next area open. Good. You were kidding. It's like a crypt. I thought Belters recycled their dead. We do. We don't get to be sentimental. We use every ounce of every resource we have. It's how we survive. So what do you think happened here? Maybe the people here were abandoned and got desperate. They could have thought they needed the bodies for something. Could be. 
No. <clears throat> he thought he put him into stasis, preserved the body, and then some advanced intelligence would bring him back to life at a later date. We've already figured that out, drummer. Come on. Catch up. There's no sign of the core yet. I'll check the server here. Keep me posted on any more excitement you find. I'm going to be able to have a quick chat. Grateful to have company in here. Okay, so now that we know that this channel is definitely private. You can finally tell me that last night was amazing and you'll never be the same again. I'm flattered. Well, I was going to, but you know what? If you want to give that attitude, love, we'll just have to repeat it again. I was just going to say that it was very nice. It really, really, really was. Okay. Oh, have I? Oh, I might have missed one. I didn't realise. Yeah. Back at the other area, there was another bit to say. Never mind. Hopefully it wasn't too important. Right. Okay. Next sector it is then. Oh, it says it's unlocked. Um, hello? Have I missed something? Ah, here we go. Power converter. Right, let's have a... Oh, no, that's just a collectible. Fine. Will I mess up your work if I remove this power converter? It's fine. That's a backup from their first attempt at wiring this place. They must have had no idea what would work long-term in microgravity. Just threw a bunch of caca at the wall and saw what didn't float. Whatever else this group was, they were brave. Yes. Um, oh, hello. Are you... Now, are you an actual gap or... No, because it's not letting me go any higher. Fine. Okay. Um, slight issue. Yeah, um, I can't see anything around, and the door's not opening. Okay, you know what, maybe it's because I was going the wrong way. <laughs> yeah, okay, I thought this was the way that I've been. No, that's the way I came in this way. That's why it's not letting me out. I should have known because the power control's there. Right. That took me an embarrassingly long amount of time to figure out. Right, so... Okay, what have we got in here? Okay, um, Smash Screen and... Timo Moffat, 22 weeks, 12-8, Mori Um Hassan, Abdu Fahazi, 08, seven weeks okay no idea what any of that means please strap in and wait to be called okay so five oh okay i'd never let this happen to me i've got my recycler all picked out okay yeah but you're not hoping to be reanimated down the line though are you the hands of the king are the hands of a healer, and so shall the rightful king be known. Loving memory of Dr. Amin Jahani. Now that you are lost, we all are. Okay. Looks like the medic was well liked. Yes, well of course he was. He's trying to keep everybody healthy. Okay, and no, bloody hell, coffins everywhere. Huh. All these poor Sabakawalas staring at the abyss for eternity. Yes. Okay, message from the dead, okay. I submit this recording alongside the station's medical records for future study. Though I take less faith than Dalton and foreign visitors. I have hope our tragedy will prove instructive to the burgeoning field of extraterrestrial immunology. 
The pandemic which decimated this station began as a standard mycobacterium tuberculosis infection. <coughs> I contend it was our antibiotic air filters which provoked the initial evolutionary surge. But <coughs> it was the children born to this station whose stunted immune systems provided the fatal breeding grounds. <coughs> I did all I could. In truth, we all did. But we had no chance. Okay, right. Um, so that's what happened then. He didn't kill himself as I thought. They um, were infected. Right. Okay, well, I'll collect you anyway. They were taking supplements to combat living in microgravity. Wonder if it's the same stuff we take. I doubt it. The only reason we survive now is because of what we learned from settlements like this. Okay. And yeah, I've just noticed that on my backpack here, the lights show me how many things I've collected. So, okay, I know if there's still lights that need lighting up, I've missed something. But we'll see if we can find it. These must be from whoever planted the MK core. We're close. Okay, fine. Apparently we're close. I'm guessing they're going to be in the mines, the core is. Because so why would back it... back to Ceres and leaving the Artemis without a captain? I suppose that's true. Damn. If I knew last night was a one-off, I would have gotten even less sleep. I will. Miss you too. Oh, for fuck's sake. At least call me a well walla, or tell me how you can kick my Martian ass. I will miss kicking your ass, well, Walla. Thank you. Okay. Fine. Right, and yeah. Got to do this again. Right, connect you. And... Okay, is this going to be any easier? Or... We... Right, we're going left on this one. That's going to take us to... Oh, okay. You're down to that one. What's round? Yeah, so I want to go left on you. Then down. Okay. And just follow it down a minute. Oh, sneaky, sneaky. Okay. I want the top one for you. There we go. And you. Put you down there. And the final one. Boom. Thank you. Right. Into the, well, not final section, but yeah. The final section before the final section, I guess. Okay, what have we got? Make sure there's nothing, yeah, hiding around any corners. And you know what? Let's, let's fly this one. Because it looks like there's oh, a couple of different ways to go. Okay. And yeah, don't trust that I won't fall. Oh, actually, there we got That's the whole. Okay, that's just down. But I did see over here. Yeah, something over here. A monument. You seeing this? Sure am. How has all of this just been sitting here? Their stories were abandoned, just like they were. What gets me is that there was no OPA back then. There wasn't even the word Belter. But as soon as they got out here, somehow their lives didn't matter anymore. Huh. Well, if that's how you feel, welcome to the OPA. I'm serious. I'm serious too. The OPA isn't just for duck orphans on series. It's for anyone who wants to fight for a free belt. At least that's what it should be. Okay. Fine, and, ooh. Okay, you've got... 
Oh, why is there another nav beat? Someone's definitely here. There is definitely somebody else here. I could have forgiven the first nav beacon because, you know, Maya could have put it down. But the fact that there's one here where we've not been yet. Yeah, that tells me there's definitely somebody who's here before us. Okay. Nothing. Ah. Oh, okay. It's not letting me turn that on. Fine. Well. Okay. Let's see what I can find. In fact, you know what? While we're here, let's start with the nav beacon. See if that set gives me any clues or anything first. Another nav beacon. We must be getting close to the core. Okay, fine. And hello. What are we going to learn about you? Looks different from the coffins in the upper sectors. Maybe they built it in the early days, before they ran out of supplies. Okay, fine. Makes sense, yeah. The early coffins were made out of the actual stuff they wanted, and... Yeah, when they ran out of that, they used what they could. Okay, mining charges. Is that collectible or something we're going to need? mining charges here. Looks disarmed. Wait. How much do they look disarmed? Disarmed enough. You clearly haven't handled many explosives. Guilty as charged. Okay, fine. Just salvage. That's not a problem. Oh, a minute. Oh no, you're just a light. Okay. All right. One last bit to check, and then we'll go up the way it wants me to go. Jeez. Okay. Oh. Okay. Not much. In fact, I don't think there's any way through that. No. Okay. I ain't know where you want me to go. Um. Oh, I mean, there we go. Something up here first. Is this where the broadcast came from? Could be a transmitter. Okay. Fine. And no, I'm not going to get any higher than this. Okay. Okay, I think that's this room thoroughly searched. So. Right. Can I do anything with yous? Not yet, but I'm guessing that's going to be something we'll have to do in a bit. Okay. Okay, okay. Watch out for an ambush. Watch out for who knows what. Come on. Show me. Okay. Right. Oh, jeez. Don't do that to me. I wasn't ready for that. Okay, um, nothing, and, no, nothing down there, fine, okay, made it to the third station, and I'm gonna assume, again, it's set, okay, maybe something hasn't loaded in, um, We'll see, but oh, circuit boards. There we go. Let's get you quickly. Thank you. And apparently we've got two more to go. Okay, so that's where we're going. Where the big three is, it's green. Yeah. Okay. Alright, see. Let's um turn this on. Oh no, it's just closed. It's okay, it's fine. thinking about something. Whatever this treasure is, the one thing we know is that it will change everything. No more scavenging, no more running. That's the hope. The thing is, I think if I had all the money in the world to do anything I wanted, 
it would be doing this with you. Okay, not this exactly, but working with you to help build a better future for the belt. I want to be a part of it, if you'll have me. I mean, I'd be lucky to have you. So would the OPA. As long as you're sure that's what you really want. I want to be a part of something that matters. And I want to be with the only person who's ever made me feel like I matter too. That's a lot of coffins. Holy shit, this is beautiful. 